Hey YouTube, I decided to make a video here, share a little gizmo that I made. It's a uh, mold guide for the Lee 420 casting pot. I started off with a piece of quarter inch Luan. Decided to make it out of wood just to make sure it all works before I start cutting into aluminum. But it goes on here pretty simple. I made it so it's adjustable for the different molds. <clears throat> like right here, it's in the lock position all the way to the right. And here it moves over to the left. I can lock it into position with this swing nut. Anyway, it seems to work okay. The reason I made it adjustable, here's a NOE mode, here's a Lee mold, you can see they're both the same width. But a lot of us have these two cavity Lee molds, and you can see there's a big difference in them. So, actually, it's a quarter inch, so you got to have the the guide moved one quarter inch, you know, if you want it to work properly. So anyway, this this came out pretty good, I thought. There's the dimensions if you ever want to try to be foolish enough to try to make one like I did. Now I didn't have quarter inch would have been ideal, or even eighth inch, but. The only piece of aluminum I had laying around was half inch. So it's a little more difficult to get on there. You have to loosen this bolt up is all, to give it some clearance. If you had, like I say, if you had an eighth inch or quarter inch, it would be a piece of cake to get it in there. This really isn't all that bad, but I'll take it back. On video, things will go wrong. There. Then you got to bring this up. Tighten this nut down here. Once you get it on here, you'll probably never take it off again anyway, but I'll put it all together just to show you how it works. Naturally, when I get on camera, it takes longer. There. But anyway, slides back and forth like that. Just locks it into place so nothing moves. And I believe it's not oh, this is for the wide ones. This is your Lee six cavity. And that lines it right up for the four spout down here. Same thing for your NOE mold. Then if you want to Use your two cavity mold. You just move it over, lock it down, and use it like that. Anyway, I thought it was, I kept looking for a simple way to do this with something that I had laying around the house. This is half inch aluminum angle iron, but you have to file this down to at least three eighths of an inch. 
to clear the uh, six cavity lee mold otherwise it'll hit the handle but it really wasn't that hard to make you drill three holes to uh, and slot them to make it move back and forth fourth hole there for the drip and the fifth hole down here for the I think that's a two and a half inch bolt Uh, two inch and a wing nut and a couple of other nuts. I have it double nutted here, and I set it at the right height so I can put my little catch pan there for the drippings. And that way, I just make a ingot out of the drippings. But uh, anyway, I wanted to share that with y'all in case somebody was interested in making one. There was all the dimensions. It was. Basically, all I did was this five and a half inches across here, so I made this five and a half, and I went five inches back this way. The center of the three, or well, the two pins in this bolt is three quarter inches from the edge, four and an eighth from this front section, half inch from the front section. This is three and a half inches from the far edge one and three quarter to center here anyway that's how you do it if you want to make one anyway thank you very much